Hey. Just about to work, which is about three miles from the house. Coming up to uh, the street I lived down when I was 10 when I moved here. That's uh, Vers- Versailles Ave. And it was my uh, grandparents' house. Unfortunately, my parents lost it in the 80s, which I would have loved to, if I was a few years older, I would have taken it over. This street's changed a lot. Nice residential street, way at the top of the hill we lived. Uh, took a lot of trees out because there's an airport here and there's been a couple of planes that have clipped the trees. Well, there's a lot of traffic. And uh, so we're coming up to the store here in about a couple of minutes. And most of the snow here is gone because uh, it usually melts faster for some reason. The way the terrain is, I don't know what it is, but it's more open. Not as sheltered, I think. So it always tends to uh, melt quicker. What a good walk. I haven't walked this far in a while. It's taken me uh, about 45 minutes, like I said. Let's see. I left about 5 after 10. 10.44. So, less than 45 minutes to get here. And today's uh, April 2nd, 2015. The airport's over here. I get a better shot when I get past this red house. And all I'll do is I'll go home and start uploading these videos. Uh, I don't go until 3, and it's not quite 11 yet, so I go home and shower, eat, work 3 to 8, and then uh, get tomorrow off. And then Saturday, I think I work 12 to 6. And then uh, I got to. Uh, work another week and on my first vacation uh, or my first vacation coming up uh, this year I get four weeks because I'll be here at the store 12 years oh, I can't believe it's been be 12 years in May next month as soon as I get past the red house here you get a you can't really see much of the airport from the road because it's down this other road and there's a uh, medical building they built in this well it's kind of a swampy area uh, let's see and there's a store over there my another goal this year is I want to uh, walk from my house down this way to street called Cole Avenue in Williamstown, which is, I say, from here another two, two and a half miles, and then walk back. And I average, it's about nine, between nine and ten and a half miles. So that's going to be a, a, a one-day thing, so. But the airport's over here. Yeah, can't really see much. Everything's really still muddy and wet and I noticed when I, when I walked earlier this week, it was kind of crappy, so. And there's areas I, even today, walking on the sidewalk, there's uh, clumps of clumps of snow. And there's a gully there that has quite a bit of snow in it still. And they have uh, scenic flying uh, tours at, at the airport here, so. I'm going to cross... This is the airport road. I just want to get over here to the store. And what I'll do is, uh, on my way back, I'm going to go back the same way. And I'm probably do a similar uh, tour thing, or whatever you want to call it, tutorial. I'm just trying to document my walking and how frequent I can do this particular walk. I'd rather done this on a day off because it is about six miles, plus I still have to work. So it's, and I, the only thing I've had today was a yogurt and a uh, water and a little bit of granola, that's it. 
So I'm, I'll probably start getting hungry really soon. But I'm just trying to see if I can optimize my weight loss without taking in so many calories. So I'm going to go visit my co-workers at the, at the pharmacy. And then uh, I'll get back in a little bit. Have a great day. Thank you.